Hello people of the internet. Now a few months ago I did a review of these which are the Tulia glitter paint pens. I actually compared them to the Zayar glitter paint pens and preferred these ones. Um, that review is linked so you can go and see it. And then recently I got hold of these which are by a different company called Colourful Art company glitter pen and going by the picture they look very very similar now I'm just going to take this box out of the way because this is actually an empty box <laughs> because my pens are in here so let's grab one of these out this is the Thule Art pen and so open these up and this is the what should we start calling these ones Colourful art, what is this, green production, colouring books, where are you? Scrapbooking, journaling, drawing, doodling, school projects, homework, crafts. Let's grab one of these, let's take that one because it looks like the same colour. And it's not quite the same colour, so let's take that one instead. Possibly, maybe. Oh, it's more that one, isn't it? So let's put them back together and you can see these look identical apart from the Thule Art ones have a sticker number on the top the bottom is the same as well and nib wise <coughs> let's do the back of my hand Yep, they're the same plastic nib. Okay, so what we're going to do, this one has a coloured, um, I was going to say feral. I think it's called a feral. Nib casing, that's what we'll call it. This one has a coloured nib casing, this one just has a white one. But other than that, they are identical. So what I'm going to do is previously I uh, swatched uh, these out. Uh, and the bottom of the sheet was the Zayar glitter pen. So I'm going. What I'm going to do is going to re-swatch these and compare them to the colours of these. Because interestingly, <laughs> when I bought these, these were nine pound. No, they were twelve pound ninety nine. They went on a special deal a few weeks later to nine ninety nine, which is when I bought my mama box as well. These are now thirty one ninety nine. Whereas these. Are less than £10. There are 12 and there are 16 of these and when I bought them they was on a special deal and they were £7.99. So pen price wise that's a difference of one ninety nine. well almost £2 to be quite honest. 16 for £32 is £2 and 66p, 67p for these. So this is three times the price of this. So let's see if it's three times as good. So I've printed out a swatch sheet and these are the 16 Thule Art pens and these are the spaces where I'm gonna put the matching colors of the colorful art glitter paint pens. Um, as always, I've put a little bit of squidge behind. So we've got a little bit of squidge behind. Now I was actually going to swatch these off camera because you've seen me sw swatching them before and you don't necessarily need to see it again. However, when I started to try and uh, get one going, I really, really struggled to get it going. So I thought that actually might be worth watching. Might be worth you seeing how difficult it is to get these pens going when you haven't used them for a while. I mean, it might have just been that one, might have just been random, but let's... Let's do it. So this is number one. And I will speed up the, uh, you know, if they just flow nicely, I'll just speed it up. But let's just give them a shake. Give them a pump. So they, they seem to be going. And uh, away they go. It's very scratchy. Let's zoom you in a little bit so you can see. What's Now this is iris number one. I'm going to give it a little more, a few more pumps. That's better. Okay. Okay, so that's number one. 
like I say, if these all just kick start really nicely then I'll just fold it on. Just making sure I'll give all of them a shake until you can hear that ball bearing moving around. screen here I am just pumping it to try and get it flew in you see I can't get this one working again this is what was happening with that brown one Let's give it another shake a bit better and oh, then it just dies okay okay well it is what it is misty pink we're doing now number three exactly what I'm doing here so I'm pump pump now remember these were hard to get started I remember these pens were much harder to get started than the spectrum noir ones shake vent maybe it's the vent that I'm not doing okay shake vent no I don't think you have to do that every time Press, paint, recap is what it says. Okay. Next, these, um, I would say, when I bought these for 12 99 I thought they was worth the money. Let me just say, if it was me buying them now, $31.99, I'd just say I just paid $31.99 for them. I would not. This one looks all right. Yes, that's much better. You heard me saying I wouldn't pay thirty-one ninety-nine for them, so I decided to to work nicely. Or a bit better anyway. Uh, was that four? Yeah, number five. Five is orange copper. What I'm going to do now is just speed up the video. You've seen that there is a mix of working and hard to get going, but we can just speed up from this point. doesn't even sound like it's got any ball movement in it at all. Do they go solid once they've got air in them inside, do you think? It's like they literally dry out. As soon as you break the seal on, the air gets into them. Literally, you can't hear anything in this pen. It's like it's dry. Thirteen. See, hear that one? And the, the lip, the lids are quite tight. That one I just did, misty blue. They clip. Oh, 
stabbed me again and the thing came out. You can feel the pump. Look at that. Look at me. I'll turn the camera off and go and get a tissue. Clean ish. Now, this one should flow nicely. The tips come off of it. Nope. That was the one I had trouble with earlier. And finally, in this beautiful selection of <laughs> glitter pens, is Sparkly Black. Sparkly Night, sorry. Shake. We can hear liquid, we can hear the ball. Okay, this one looks optimistic. I'm wondering if they dry up after a certain amount of time. Okay, so that is the... <laughs> Truly art. Now if you want to see what they actually came out like when I first watched them. Where's my swatch book? Oh, hold on. Okay, so this. This is what they looked like when I first, that green one never really worked, did it? Oh, it's not green, it's supposed to be gold. Yeah, they were better when I first watched them. Most definitely. Okay, so let us put these back in their box. Make sure the lids are all on nice and tightly. Now do the new ones. Oh. Now these don't have names or numbers on them. Yes, I don't think they do. Glitter pen, three years plus, one millimetre. Shake, air out, push, right, recap. Exactly the same as the other one said. Which the other one said, shake, vent, press, paint, recap, shake, air out, push, right, recap. Okay, now, oops, what I should have done is match the lids up, but maybe it doesn't really matter. I'm going to go with this one as being iris, because they look... Similar. So, oops, need to squishy thing, and I'm gonna sneeze. Hold on. Bless me. Can feel movement in there. Okay, vent. We have vented. We have broke the seal. Press and press and press. If these are like. Well, I say if these are like the Thule Art, they're the exact same pens with different labels on them. Um, then they they did take a while to uh, vent when I did them originally. Okay, so flows nicely in the beginning. So did the Thule Art ones in the beginning. So that is number one. <laughs> uh, number two is this one, so it's either that one. Or that one. So we're going for this one. Shake. I don't know how much to shake for. Vent. Pump. And squiggle me diggle. say in the beginning the truly art ones were as good as this right which is the next color misty pink number three is that that one sure looks similar so, shake i have my hand here and i just bash it against my hand blush red is the next one before I would say they're the same. Uh, what is it? Shake first, isn't it? <laughs> You'd think I'd know after 28 pens. Very, very fluid that one was. If I hold it up, you see how wet they are. Okay, gold nugget is next. 
on that one. Yeah, the seagulls. When the seagulls follow the trawler, it is because they hope to catch some fish. Oh, that's nice, that one, isn't it? It's like copper. It's even called orange copper. Beautiful. Beautiful. Gold nugget is next. Must be this one. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, six. Gold nugget. Yes. Shake. Oh, this one's not making any noise. Loosen its ball, maybe. There we go. There must be in there a big globule of glitter. And you need to stir it up. <laughs> okay, invent. Very yellow, that one. Uh, this one doesn't look the same as that green. Doesn't look the same as that green. And then the other green. There are three greens. And it looks different to all of them. So I'm just going to... It is a different colour green, I think. Let's have a look. And it's very similar to the pale jade. Yeah, I guess it was that one, really. Okay. Next, lagoon green. Okay, that's that one. <laughs> good work at this one. Get rid of your bingo wings. They may not get any good for paint drawing, colouring. Oops, I forgot to vent. vent. But a great exercise out routine for your bingo wings. I don't have bingo wings. Oh, look at that. That looks exactly like the gel hybrid. Really bright, bluey green. Let's hold it up so you can see what I can see. Do you see what I See, look at it. Yeah, same colour as might be a tad darker, but it does look a bit darker. Maybe because it's dried and that's wet. Okay, next is aqua blue, which is that one. See? Oh look how much came out. Oop. Again. Fabulous colour. Did lids click? No, not really. Okay, next is lapis blue. Lovely, and then we've got this silvery one, which I am going to guess hmm. could be that one, and then that one could be that one. Yes, because that's a bluey one. Okay, so this is 13, and this one's 16, so this one's 13. Like I say, these haven't got numbers on them, I'm just matching them. Okay, this has got no noise. Whatever's in there isn't moving. Oops, sorry. Vent. Vent. Pump. I don't think anything's going to come out of here. One eternity later. The shadow as we go long into the night. Darkness came. And the pumping of the pen still continued. Thirteen, stark silver. Mm -hmm. 
It looks lighter than that other silver. Like if there was a, such a thing as a cool grey silver and a warm grey silver, it would be a cool grey silver. Bit lovely for snow, that. Oh, that one clipped really nicely. Why didn't that one? Well, it does sort of clip. And then this last one is one that should be the black, the sparkly night, 16. So, shake. Yes, we can hear the ball. Maybe that silver one's thicker so you can't hear the ball. So that's that. So the ones that we don't get are Misty Blue, Beige Gold and Hickory Brown. And there's the black. So these are the pens that you can currently get for. And I'm going to get their real right price right this minute, second on time. Right, today this box of 12 colourful art glitter pens on Amazon.co.uk linked down below are 9.99 as i said when i bought them they was on a special deal and i got them for 7.99 um so if you want them <laughs> maybe wait but to be quite honest that works out 83p a pen which compared to the tuli art which are now two pound a pen these are better value i mean they're exactly the same pen but that said if you're desperate 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 for the tuli art get these but bear in mind, these Thule Arts are less than, just checked, bought them in August. So August, uh, six months old, they're less than six months old, or I've had them in my possession for less than six months. I have used them in two colouring books, They, and then they've been kept in an ambient temperature <laughs> um, since then. So, I mean, these will probably go the same way. It seems like once you break the seal, um, they dry out. So, if you're desperate for these, get these, but use them quickly. And I wouldn't spend £31.99, £32 on the Thule Art version. So, thanks very much for watching. Hope this for you, this was useful, especially for uh, anyone interested in the Thule Art pens. Take care, everyone. Bye! I actually decided to do a stay tuned to the end bit and have a look, re-look at the Spectrum Noirs because okay these ones not so much they're newer let's be let's be realistic these ones were bought around the same time let's see if like the Thule art ones they've gone dry so wait for the focus to come back there we go oh you can hear the ball shaking let's give it a pump and let's give it a swatch no they, <laughs> the Spectrum Noir ones, get my vote every time. Uh, I should put how much they are per pen in this box here because I'll have to stop and look it up. But definitely, let's just check one more to make sure that we ain't just picked a good one. Now you can hear the ball so much better in there than this one. Yeah, they're way better. Spectrum Noir ones are way just better <laughs> in my opinion thanks for watching bye